So I was admiring my forearm today and I thought to myself, hmm, there's got to be some fresh new golf content. There has to be. So I searched my channel and then it hit me. Yes, you can see match play, scrambles, and most of the golf content on my channel. However, what if you want something new, something fresh? Hmm. So I went to the range, um, had a look around as I normally do. Wasted a few balls. Lovely looking range there, Stonebridge. Superb course. And I thought of the range roulette cup. Hello golfers, so I'm here at Stonebridge Golf Range today, the local home of golf. I'm going to be talking you through the new range cup I have in store. Cheers mate, yeah, cheers Mark. thank you. Cheers. Hello keen golfers, we got a treat in store for you. This is a brand new concept that I believe is new to YouTube, no one's ever done it before. We've got 21 golfers from our society playing in this range cup. It's going to be a range challenge, it's going to be a roulette system, so every round you spin the wheel, it's man standing, and I'll sort of pause out at the end of the stage soon for that. The first stage of the roulette cup, there's going to be six different challenges. There's going to be a driver challenge, there's going to be a picking challenge, and it's going to be the first ever, as far as I'm aware, stinger challenge. Range in the winter in Stonebridge. So I've got a range of abilities playing, so it'll, um, it'll be a laugh. Like I say, it's a knockout, so anything can happen. Total points at the end wins, progress to the next round, and then we, we charge it up from there, different challenges. Yeah, so stay tuned. Now for the groups. Group one. We have Mr. International, rookie. He loves a Welsh trip. Great centre back and a great golfer. Oh, it's going red. Yeah, hey, yeah. on the beach. Number two, Mr. Paddy Fleetwood. Ping, G424. It's a great stroll. <laughs> <laughs> it's exactly like Fleetwood, but you don't play like him. The third person in Group 1, Dust Cap Dylan. I'm sure he'll explain in further videos. And we have the fans' favourite, the Moroccan magician. Top salesman, loves getting to a final, but he seems to never turn up. And to conclude group one, we have Mr. 90 Degrees, or the three wood maestro, as he would call himself. He's a major champion. Go on, T! Yes, T! <laughs> but it does love a shank. Go on to group two of the roulette cup. We begin with the half-hearted golfer. My brother, um, he don't really like golf, I don't know why he's into golf. Still playing football at the age of 85 years old. Thinks he's a top forward, injury prone as. The second golfer in group two is the Henry Edge Golf. Mr. Callaway himself, it's Ashley Henry. Some say he's got the best looking swing in Birmingham. The third golfer in the lineup of group two is the Digby Drawer. Uh, the Digby is his local pub and he loves drawing the ball, hence the name. He does love a comeback. Uh, he has got other nicknames which I don't like to mention um, due to past videos. But he do not really like setting up squares to the ball for some reason. But it does work because he's a five handicapper. The fourth golfer in this group is Mr. Spice Cakes. The name says it all, but if you don't know, Wes has the munchies. And he also I've got written down here, he's an expert in sheds. So, make of that of what you will. I 
last goal fight in Group 2. He's a new member to our society. He's the silent assassin. No one really knows much about him. Goes off on his own, does his own thing. Very determined golfer. And his draw creeps up out of nowhere. Group 3, we'll start off with Mr. Box Office. He loves the attention. He's definitely got some Chinese heritage and he loves a free membership. Golfer number two of group three is the pencil. As he's been on the channel a few times, featured uh, with me in various series. He just hits strike balls all day, all night. Yeah. The one. Yeah, shot again. Just on. He sinks 30 foot putts, does love an auto. Following that up, we have Tiny Tots. He's the only teacher within the society. He does love his notebook in the classroom and outside the classroom. He's a great golfer, but he hates the winter. And he does like wearing Tiny Tots. Following that, we have Shankopotamus. Name says it all, really. Last but not least, in group three, we have the King Golfer. I've seen him on the channel before, got a few things written down here. Um, he's a legend, he's a legend it says. He loves golf, football, but he does love getting injured as well. Um, he's currently nursing an ACL injury. He's still still a 30 handicapper, so he's not doing too bad. Yeah, enough about him. The final group of the Roulette Cup starts us off with Jammy Jake. He loves red Julies. Do I get to hold it and take a picture? This one's grey, but he loves a red one, bright red one. Very draw biased, but he does love a chipping as well. Second up, we've got Bunker Boy Bash. He's in recruitment, but he recruits more bunkers than clients. Following this up, we've got BTEC Bryson. He loves hitting a big ball, the most forgiving driver on the market. He loves Scotty Camerons, also loves Bulldogs. Following up that, we've got Furious Festa. He loves a point, he don't really like anyone. Uh, the only person he likes in the group is the Keen Golfer. And also, he don't like waiting, especially on the tee box. The fifth golfer in the last group is the deadly Dunlop, Stephen. He's got the oldest putter in the world. does love his doubles partner a bit too much, if you know what I mean. But he does sink anything inside 10 foot. Final person, baby fade Bradders. He loves to tee down, play that nice squeezy fade. Yes, Brad. He used to play for Wolverhampton as well. And he's got a great looking sister because I am his brother-in-law. So that concludes the video. Um, we've been through the rounds, the rules. Uh, the participants. I'm looking forward to this new series. I think it's going to be good. I think it's something different. It's random every round, so you don't know who you're playing. So stay tuned for the videos to come. Um, forgot to mention the prize for this competition. It's going to be anything from a new driver, £100, or an all-inclusive trip to Stonebridge. That will include two beers, a free round on me, also, comment down below any ideas you've got for the challenges. That would be helpful. And as always, like and subscribe if you can, if you like the videos. And finally, there is a Turkey Trot major video coming out soon. Um, just in the process of editing that. So keep an eye out for that. I'll put the link up there so you can check that out if you want.